in my last video I said everyone on Tiger King is a bad person except for Carol Baskin. I don't know if that's true. I think Joe probably doesn't care if he lives in kind of bad conditions. So, um, he probably isn't as concerned about the Tiger's well-being as other people. But Joe also loves the Tigers. That's for sure. Um, but more than anything, Joe is trying to make a living with Tigers. And so, um, I think that's why Joe is suspicious of Doc Antle, um, and, he th and he thinks this guy's killing cubs because he wants to kill cubs because it would be easier to, t to kill cubs. Because once those tigers are big, you have to feed them. So, um, I don't know. All, all I know is um, you can't label people good or bad. Obviously, Joe is... A sewer and, and people that sue people a lot in my opinion tend to be bad people which anyways this is a completely different topic but Paris Hilton it's crazy watching Miley Cyrus interview her and I'm sitting there going um, can you ask her about the hotel business because I know everyone is mad right now because the casinos got a bailout and the Hiltons have a hotel in Vegas um, that I'm pretty sure is I think it's just getting a loan and um, even with the loan, they're, they're probably screwed because you have to pay back the loan and you have that many employees and it's only covering half the employee's salary. And um, at some point, you start to go, um, is it really worth it? Um, but I feel like hotels are, a, a lot of the people that work for hotels are in the, they don't have salaries, they have their hourly workers. Um, but I don't know. All I know is the Tropicana Hotel is owned by the Hiltons and they got money from the government. And I think what people don't understand is um, how important casinos are for the United States economy. That's why um, Resorts World is a Malaysian owned. That's why a Malaysian company is building Resorts World in Las Vegas when it was that expensive for them to build. Resorts World is a hotel that is, is the newest hotel in Vegas that... Um, is being built right now. Um, the, the reason that they are building that hotel is because it's good for, it's good for them financially. From a, I, I think it's from a currency perspective because so many people travel to Las Vegas from other countries. So Las Vegas is an important tourism hub, just like Macaw is, and we have casinos in Macaw, or at least Sheldon Adelson has casinos, and I, I think so does Wynn. A, a lot of people have casinos in Macaw, and um, and so. Um, that's why they want to have casinos here too because it's that important of a business and so that's why the government had to bail out casinos as as much as it makes some people like me our skin is kind of crawling so anyways Paris Hilton seems like she's fine and she's a businesswoman that is in the hotel and casino business but especially the hotel business and you want to talk about a business that is not fine um everyone in the real estate market is going no matter what you tell me we're screwed because the like yeah the government will buy all the securities okay the government has more mortgage backed securities and then what we have to um, we have to have the government own these properties that no one is in so was the, is, at some point is the government going to just donate the properties back and be like hey I'll, I'll sell it to you back I'll sell it back to you at a lower price or something but then that's going to affect them so at some point um we have to accept that real estate markets follow their own trends. But I heard that luxury real estate rentals are up, uh, which is crazy to me because I would think that luxury real estate would be the biggest hit right now, or at least like the, the low luxury real estate, like the million area. I don't know. Anyways. Yeah. I, I'm sure everyone's lives are, a lot more. I, I, that's what when Donald Trump's bragging about his ratings. I don't think he understands how stressed out everyone is right now.